The BO-105 is a legend. There are several records, a long distance record, with more than 1,714 kilometers. The BO-105 was the first helicopter ever to fly a looping. And at that point in time, it was also the, the first helicopter to reach a speed with uh, 404 kilometers per hour. The first flight uh, was on the 16th uh, of February, 1967. At the point the uh, BO-105 was developed, it was the most innovative helicopter of its time. It was designed for as a multi-purpose helicopter with the most modern technology and material. The rigid rotor system, the dual hydraulic system, the rotor blades made out of glass fiber and Never before have been a helicopter uh, with two engines in this class. At its time, the BO-105 dominated the market, especially due to its high safety levels with the two engines, the high maneuverability and uh, the greatly useful load capacity due to the clamshell doors, where a helicopter of this size and class you could first load from the back. And the helicopter itself with its high set tail rotor was able to land in confined areas. It's up till today used for all kinds of mission, for emergency rescue services, especially with uh, the load capacity and the ability to help the uh, persons during flights. It was of great use in uh, Europe. We use it for police, the military. The German military was one of the biggest customers we have and uh, as well transportation and VIP transport. It is one of the few helicopters that is able to fly aerobatic. Red Bull is still flying with four BO-105s in uh, Europe and America and their aerobatic shows are well known. In total we built 1,400 BO-105s. Roughly 400 uh, units uh, still in operation and fulfilling their task. Everywhere, so they are flying in the middle of Africa in extreme heat, but as well under extreme weather conditions at the South Pole. About two years ago, the fleet reached the milestone of 8 million flight hours. If uh, you compare that, 8 million hours is close to 1,000 years. It is a legend. Thank you.